Okay, 2022 National 5 Maths exams. Let's do percentages, which is going to cover appreciation, reverse percentages, and percentages for a calculator. Let's start with a appreciation with a calculator. So this is from a 2015 paper to question one. A house is valued at £240,000. It's predicted to rise by 2.8% per annum. Calculate its predicted value after two years. Step one is always the same. We need to find the multiplier, what we're going to times by. So we're starting off with 100%. And it's rising by 2.8%. So that gives me 102.8%. Now we need to change that to a decimal. So we do 102.8 divided by 100. And to be safe, I'll use a calculator. 102.8 divided by 100, 1 1.028. So that is my key number, that's my multiplier, because now what I'm going to do is take my £240,000 times my multiplier, and it's to the power of however many years of the time frame, so in this case 2. 240,000 times 1.028 to the power of 2. And I get 25362816. 2. Five, three, six, two, eight point one six. Last thing, don't forget your pound sign. Okay, now a question two thousand and seventeen paper two. Question two says a necklace is valued at one thousand two hundred pound. It is expected to increase by four point five percent per year over the next three years. Calculate its expected value after this time. Give your answer to the nearest pound. Be careful. Remember to round. So let's start the same way. Our multiplier. 100% plus 4.5%. That's 104.5%. Change that to a decimal by dividing by 100. And this time I won't use a calculator. It's 1.045. There's a key number. Use a calculator just to be sure. So then we take the money, 1200, times the multiplier to the power of the time, which is 3. So there we definitely need a calculator. 1,200 times 1.045 to the power of 3 is 1369.39935. Let's just write that whole thing down. 1369.39935, which equals to the nearest pound, 13. Six nine pounds. Okay, reverse percentages, but this time with a calculator. Uh, still 2015, paper two, question eight. It says James paid £297.50 for a laptop in a sale. The discount in the sale was 15%. Calculate the original price of the laptop. Here's a tip there's no time in this question, so it's probably reverse percentages. We start off in the same way by doing the multiplier. So we've got a hundred percent. It was in a discount, so it's been taken off, so minus 15%, that leaves 85%. Change that to a decimal in this normal way, divide by 100 to get 0 0.85. So now, since it's, we're going backwards, we're not going to times by 0 0.85, because we're going to try to get back to the original price, so we divide by 0 0.85. So 29750 divided by 0 0.85 calculator time exactly 350 so our answer is 350 pound notice there's no time in this question if you don't notice time, it might be divide look for things like original price Venus and Earth are two planets in our solar system the volume of Venus is 9.3 times 10 to the 11 cubic kilometers. This is 85% of the volume of Earth. Calculate the volume of Earth. Notice it does not say it's went down by 85%. It's just telling you that it's 85% of the volume of Earth. So 85% is our multiplier. Okay. So 85%, change that to a decimal. 85 divided by 100, 0.85. So we now just take our number, 9.3 times 10 to the 11, divided by 0 0.85 to get back up to 100%.
9.3 times 10 to the power of 11 divided by 0 0.85 and we get a huge number. So we've got 109411764708.82 cubic kilometers. Now, it doesn't ask us to round it or anything like that, but it's not a very reasonable number. So I will, just for the sake of this, round this to the same degree of accuracy as a question, so two significant figures. So that gives me 1.1 times 10 to the power of, well, all the numbers after the first one, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 up to the decimal place, to the power of 12, and it's cubic kilometres, so kilometres cubed. Okay, same type of question here, but this time non-calculator. I can't use a calculator at all. So it's 2014, paper one, question nine. This was from 480,000 tickets were sold for a tennis tournament last year. This represents 80% of all available tickets. Calculate the total number of tickets that were available for this tournament. I know that 80% represents 480,000. And I, know, I want to know what's 100% going to be. So I need to get down to 1% maybe, or 10%, and then back up to 100%. In this case, I, I can see that 80 does go into 480,000, so I'll find 1% by dividing by 80. 480,000 divided by 80. So I can knock a zero off straight away. Eight sixes is 48. One, two, three zeros left over. So I've got 6,000 for 1%. And therefore, a hundred percent just times them by a hundred, making sure I get all my zeros in six hundred thousand. And there we are. So, percentages most common things are reverse percentages and appreciation. There was no depreciation in the 2022 National Five exam, and reverse percentages without a calculator. Although, just be aware, you could be asked at any time to calculate a simple percentage of an amount as well as part of a question. This has been Claire Maths. Today we've done percentages in National 5 2022 exam. Take care, stay safe and goodbye.